All right, guys. This morning I am fishing with a Grande Bass. I think it's a four, four inch worm. Pretty juicy looking. And something called a jig rig. So I'm going to give it a try. moving water this morning what the hell's going on oh come on no way no. That was my original plan. Last time I was here, the water was a little clearer. So I kind of took out, you know, matching baits. I'm gonna have to get something a little darker. But I'm also gonna switch to a wacky rig. Go with the green pumpkin. Watermelon. Have one, two. I'm gonna have one left. I think I had a hit just now. Yep. That fast. Where did you go? Try over here. Boom. Perfect. I uh, cannot wait to get the boat back. Oh. Just had a hit just now. Well, it seems to be the problem lately. I got a little hit on the fall, and that's it. Fish are having a blast today. What's up, guys? Well, as you can see, I'm still struggling down here I'm trying to catch a fish. <laughs> um, I didn't have much time, I had about an hour. Um, just with a full time job, well, two full time jobs. You know, I have one that I actually get paid for. and then we have to maintain the property down here. Um, it's ours, so it's only right. It, like cutting the grass down here during the summer is a task. And look at all this grass. We 
wait, it's not done yet. Hold on. And that's not even everything. Still have back there. Even though the fishing is horrible, I don't give up because it's something that I love to do. Um, never thought I'd like making videos, just, and you know, I found something else that I like to do, and you combine that with something else I love to do. Yeah, there you go. But if there's something that you love to do, drive on 110%. Make sure you do it. Now, I was thinking the other day, when I was 18, 19, and 20, all up in that age group, I was fishing three to four times a day. I was really, really good at it. Bass fishing, I'm talking about. And it never occurred to me to be a tournament fisherman. And, you know, I was thinking lately, I think I'm going to give it a try. But before I do that, I'm not going to jump right into it. I'm going to practice um, and get in the groove of things because I'm definitely rusty. Um, back then, you know, I would leave work, drive straight to the dock, jump in the boat, and go. I was on the water by four, pulling up at dark and had no problem catching fish, none. Now if I go in that same area, well, number one, there are none, you know. It, it's, it's so hard. We've had such a change um, since that wonderful hurricane, Katrina. Um, it just changed a lot of things down here, but I'm getting off subject. Um, but that used to be my area. I would fish that area and expand it, expand, 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 and I was catching wherever I went. You know, I was learning how to adapt to what was going on, water clarity, the wind, the temperatures. I, I was, I was on. I was on. <laughs> and then I moved. Um, you know, obviously I put my family first which you, you guys should do um, but I didn't have to quit fishing I just I don't know it was kind of it, it was weird it was a weird time in my life but um, last year I picked up the poles again started fishing and um, I got to where the summertime came last year wasn't even it wasn't this bad it, it got a little slow you know it's gonna get slow with the heat but um, you know, that's when we found out Jace was on his way um, and then he uh, passed away so that really put me in a shell I guess you could say and he passed away August 24th and I don't think I started fishing again until late January. You know, um, it just it helps me clear my mind. You know, it's a stress reliever, something that I love to do. You know, and I continue to fish, and you know, so I got on YouTube. It's a great resource for anything. And watching videos, um, all the pros. You know, started watching some local guys, and then I started to see some of the um, YouTubers slash fishermen. I don't even know what you want to call them, but 
Um, you know, it's entertainment. But, you know, I also picked up a few things, too. And then it just dawned on me, you know, make a channel. So that's why, you know, one reason why I made the channel. But, um, but it's called Fishing with Jace, as you may know, because of my son that passed away. Um, so, but anyway, I'm getting off subject again. Um, like I said, if you're doing something you love, if fishing is it, stick with it. And of course, I'm talking in, to most of the younger guys out there. Um, but I'm 43 years old. Um, and here I am picking up a camera and fishing, you know, but I like it. It's fun. Um, so when I get my boat back, which I need to make a phone call, find out what's going on with it, um, I'm going to start practicing again. And it may take me six months, maybe longer, until I feel comfortable enough to enter a tournament. But when I do, y'all going to be right there. Y'all going to be there the whole way. Because I'm not going to stop videoing. So, with that said, as you can see, you got lots of grass to cut. I got things to do, I don't know, but falls are coming, things are changing. You know, you're gonna see me catching bass, redfish, speckled trout, the whole, you know, all the stuff we we catch down here. Um, so keep watching. Um, if you're not subscribed, subscribe. I have a giveaway. Uh, when I when I reach 50 subscribers, I'm gonna give away a mystery tackle box, the whole box. Um, so I'm up to 27 right now. Thank you guys. Um, but we got to get this thing to 50. Get it to 50. One of you guys are going to win. So with that said, keep on fishing. Thank you for watching. See? I told you never to give up. Look at that. Eh, just kidding. Caught him in one of our traps. Relocating fish. I'm calling to check on the boat. Hello. Hey, Troy. It's... Hey, Gene. Hey, just checking on the boat, see what's going on. Um, really, I haven't done anything to it as of yet. I'll look at it a little bit to decide how we're going to fix the transom. I'm thinking uh, is to do away with the wood and use aluminum channel in its place like we currently build the boats. Uh... <laughs> yeah. All right, well, I, I hope to be working on it you know aluminum work wise by next week where i can get everything done for you okay i'll give you i'll give you a holler in about a week and a half or so <laughs> all right gene all right thank you all right. okay bye-bye okay. oh my god <clears throat> i need my boat okay when I talk about not giving up, uh, it wasn't, wasn't what I was looking for, but you know, I decided, let me throw a line. Look at that. I think it went through his eye. But I shortened up that little worm. Try to catch some of the smaller perch in here, maybe. From the, It went down and he ate it up. Like I said, guys, don't give up. Never give up.